Children's developmental milestones are a big deal. When they master a new skill, it's an exciting time. It is, but as Sarah Wall tells us, well, one skill in particular brings up a lot of questions. A delicate topic to talk about today, bedwetting. I have received a bunch of emails from parents concerned about this very issue. Did you know that at age 7, 1 in 10 children still wets the bed at least once a week? In fact, millions of kids well into their teenage years wet the bed. Experts say it really is pretty common. That's because when our kids are mastering potty training during the day, they're learning a new skill. We practice that and help them figure it all out. But nighttime dryness is totally different. Doctors say it's a subconscious skill that really cannot be taught or practiced. Many experts agree that wetting the bed isn't something that discipline, practice, or rewards will help overcome. And understanding it many times depends on how long it's been going on. If it's a new situation, my first thought would be to go to a doctor and make sure you don't have a bladder infection. Um, also, make sure there's nothing else going on, like some anxiety. Did a new situation just happen where they just moved? Did they just start a new school? Because those things can also change as well. Doctors say medical conditions can contribute to bedwetting, but many children who wet the bed don't have any sort of medical issue. Bedwetting often runs in the family, and many children simply grow out of it. You can help them, though, by limiting liquids before bedtime and making sure your kids make one final trip to the bathroom before climbing into bed. Some parents try to wake their kids up during the night for a bathroom visit, but most of all, you can help by providing calm reassurance that everything is okay. Make sure your little ones know that you're not mad at them. Wetting the bed can be embarrassing for our kids. For more information, for information on this, you can go to our website, fox10tv.com. In Mobile, Sarah Wall, Fox 10 News.